The Stoning of Saraya M, a true story by Freydown Sahebjim is a gripping narrative that exposes the brutal realities of misogyny and injustice in a small Iranian village. This literary analysis will delve into the various themes and literary devices employed by the author to convey the chilling account of Saraya's tragic fate. Sahebjim's storytelling technique is both immersive and powerful. By adopting a first-person narrative style, the author presents himself as the protagonist and primary witness to the events. This approach allows the reader to experience the story through the author's eyes, creating a sense of immediacy and authenticity. Furthermore, Sahebjim's choice to recount the events as a true story lends credibility and amplifies the impact of Saraya's plight. One of the central themes in the book is the oppression of women in Iranian society. Sahebjim exposes the deeply ingrained patriarchy that permeates every aspect of life in the village. Through Saraya's character, he portrays the unjust treatment of women as second-class citizens, subjected to male dominance and archaic traditions. The stoning itself serves as a chilling symbol of this oppression, illustrating the extreme lengths to which the village's men are willing to go to maintain their control. Another significant theme explored in the book is the corrupting influence of power. Sahebjim paints a bleak picture of the village's religious and political authorities, who exploit their positions for personal gain and to enforce oppressive practices. The character of Hashem, Saraya's husband, exemplifies the abuse of power as he manipulates the village's leaders to orchestrate Saraya's execution. Through this depiction, Sahebjim highlights the moral bankruptcy of those entrusted with upholding justice and morality. Religion also plays a significant role in the narrative. Sahebjim does not condemn Islam outright but criticizes the manipulation of religious doctrines to justify horrific acts of violence and discrimination. The author portrays a stark contrast between the compassionate teachings of Islam and the twisted interpretations used to suppress women and maintain control. This nuanced portrayal allows the reader to distinguish between the true principles of a religion and the distorted ideologies used to further personal and political agendas. Sahebjim's use of vivid imagery enhances the emotional impact of the story. The author paints a vivid picture of the village, with its desolate landscapes and oppressive atmosphere, amplifying the sense of isolation and despair experienced by Saraya and other women in the community. Furthermore, his descriptions of the stoning scene are haunting and graphic, eliciting a visceral reaction from the reader and underscoring the brutality of the act. In conclusion, The Stoning of Saraya M. is a harrowing account of injustice, oppression, and the abuse of power. Through his immersive storytelling, Sahebjim sheds light on the plight of women in a patriarchal society, exposing the depths of cruelty and hypocrisy that can exist within seemingly ordinary communities. By delving into themes of gender inequality, corruption, and religion, the author provokes reflection and raises important questions about the universal struggle for justice and human dignity.